Cuyahoga Valley National Park is located near Cleveland, Ohio, and was first established as a recreation area in 1974, then received its National Park designation in 2000. Its 33,000 acres consist of deep forest, rolling hills, and open farmland. Although we both grew up just an hour away, this was our first visit. We've heard fall is the best time to visit because of the colors of the leaves, and it was absolutely true. We love the scenic drive over from Warren and feel like we picked a perfect day in October to visit our ninth national park. You won't need to make reservations or even bring your national park pass as this park is free to enter. The layout of this national park is different from all others that we have visited. This just isn't a vast stretch of unspoiled wilderness to explore. This is more like sections of protected land parcels. In addition to the protected gorges, forest, and waterways, there are also working farms and numerous homes within the park limits. At the top of our list was visiting Brandywine Falls. This waterfall is 60 feet high and one of the most popular destinations inside the park. The 1.5 mile Brandywine Gorge Loop allows you to explore beyond the waterfall. So we are at Cuyahoga National Park. We are checking out the 60 foot fall. Brandywine Falls. So oh, gorgeous here. Perfect time to go. Today is October 13th. And wow, look at this. <laughs> It's worth it though. There's lots of steps. What'd you think? That was awesome. Way never better. Know, never knew that was in Ohio. Yeah, way better than we thought it would be. Definitely a must-see. There are more waterfalls to see inside the park that we didn't get a chance to visit, so be sure to check them out when you're there. Cuyahoga Valley National Park is very dog friendly. Leashed pets are welcomed in the park as well as on over 100 miles of hiking trails. Station Road Bridge is Cuyahoga Valley's oldest metal truss bridge. According to the Park Service, the bridge was built in 1882 
and was recently renovated in 2021 for $1.3 million. The Brexville Northfield Bridge is a towering arch bridge that spans the Cuyahoga River and is a favorite spot for photographers. Typically, the Cuyahoga River gives this bridge a perfect reflection, but the water was too cloudy the day we went. We aren't complaining though because the colors surrounding it made for great photos as well. Thank you so much for watching as we took you on a little tour of Ohio's National Park. We were pleasantly surprised by the beauty there and so glad we got a chance to go this past fall. Our time was limited that day and there's a lot more the park has to offer, so be sure to do your research so you don't miss any of it. And join us next week when we take you to our absolute favorite park in Ohio, Mill Creek Park in Youngstown. It's not a national park, but it should be. This is a park that we came to when we were dating and always come back to when we return to Ohio. It's over 2,600 acres with so many beautiful spots that we can't wait to share with you. See you next week. Bye. Bye. Feet up on the dash and the calling open road. Road trip classics on the radio With your hand tied in mine There's no such thing as time Now we can go anywhere you want to go We're pleasantly, pleasantly surprised <laughs> And you, oh, oh darn it Oh man You took so easy <laughs> We got to la, 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 la. Ooh, there's no place we can go. Ooh, my home is when I'm alone.